A new cafe in Little Rock with a name many Central Arkansans will recognize. We're eating it up at the new Two Sisters Cafe location, where a classic menu comes with a twist uptown. You just happen to be in downtown Little Rock, passing La Harp and Chester. You're going to see what appears to be an old southern home with a beautiful wraparound porch. But let me tell you, something special is inside. It's sweet southern food meets an elegant dining experience. We're here at Two Sisters Uptown, and if you recognize the name, you're right. Two Sisters in Sherwood has been there for decades, and people begged, please bring this to Little Rock. <laughs> and they did, and we're going to check it out. Are you ready to eat it up? I couldn't be more ready. Let's go. The Two Sisters are a faith cabin and Sharon Holmes. They started this business um, making cakes for the church and it has just evolved into a catering and cafe which we're known for in Sherwood that's been there for 20 years. This is our new location that's been open for about five months. We have a couple of items on the menu like our famous jalapeno chicken and our fried bologna which is pretty pretty thick and everybody loves that. We have a daily special every week, turkey and dressing, roast, green beans, mashed potatoes, our cranky sister, it's one of our uh, signature sandwiches here, it's ciabatta bread with grilled chicken, fried jalapenos, jalapeno ranch, mozzarella, cheddar, and then we bake it. So it kind of gives you a warm, crunchy, I would say kind of like a pizza style sandwich. Now this bad boy called the Cranky Sister, and I honestly don't know why anyone would be cranky if you got this. And of course, you can't go wrong with some homemade onion rings, fancy little dipping sauces, all those like good familiar flavors that we love here in the South. Okay. Elevated. Bacon, Bacon, egg, some spices. This is unlike any avocado toast I've ever seen, mm. or unlike I've ever tasted. Oh my gosh. Battered eggplant fries. Double battered eggplant fries. Wow. Mm. There's a reason he talked about this being one of their most popular dishes. And it's plated so fun. You know, they've stacked it. He said he likes to put a lot of art into how he plates his items. Right. And you can tell that it's just a little touches. I hear that they call this the ding dong cake for a reason. It tastes like a ding dong. Well, it's been nice sharing this cake with you. Uh, you've ate as much as I'm willing to share though. Oh, so you're done sharing at this point? Uh, yes. Guess I'll have to get another piece for me. Oh. Sauces and a little cute little ramekins. What do you call them? Ramekin. Huh. <laughs> Baby cup. Man, y'all are making me hungry. I know, I know. It's just cool to see that this business who, you know, had been around for 20 years in Sherwood had people begging and begging, please come oh, yeah. to Little Rock, finally making their way there. It's Us, really a cool building Here too. on the south side of the river, we're trying to get some of that. <laughs> finally, uh -huh. we got one. I know. And you saw it was located in this, what, like a house, right? Yeah, if it you're kinda... driving past, it looks like a house with a nice little wraparound mm. porch, but inside, now you've got a nice cafe with the chandeliers. Yeah. It's, it's really cute. You got to check it out. Gives you like that home cooking kind of feel. Yeah, you know? I'd say so. And a little upscale element to it as well. And uh, yeah, you can't go wrong with those eggplant fries. Those were good. Yep. Double battered is the key. Double battered. <laughs> That's going to be batter. my life motto. Quadruple battered. <laughs> That's right. I don't know what comes next. It's, I know it's five. Cinco. C Cinco battered. Uno, dos, tres. You know Spanish. Help us out. Cinco, quadruple. We're, we're back in triple batter minutes on Wake Up Central.